What's up nerds, I'm Renegade Cactus, but you can call me whatever you want. Welcome to day 4 of Game Boy Advent. We want to play this in English. What is it you may ask? It's Monster Force from Uni or by Universal Digital Eclipse. That's, that's some big freaking studios. Now, Monster Force. What is it? Wait, welcome. I'm Igor, a robotic guide and shopkeeper. I have quite a story to tell you. Then I'll be here to help you on your journey. One dark and stormy night in Monsterland, three young monsters set out for an evening of fun. Their beloved creator and boss, Dr. Victor Frankenstein, stayed in the lab to put the finishing touches on his latest experiment. Dr. Victor couldn't wait to complete his project as he had high hopes it would help the world outside of Monsterland understand his special creatures. Dr. Victor thought that once the world saw how kind the monsters were, he and his brother Dr. Percy could return from Monsterland without having to fear the ignorance and hatred of the mobs that drove them to seclusion. But that night in the lab there was a shadow and a crash and... The young monsters returned to find the laboratory destroyed and Dr. Victor missing. Frank, Drag and Wolfie set off to seek the help of Dr. Percy and to find Dr. Victor. So yeah, this is Monsterland. Monster Force, I'm sorry. Monster Force set in Monsterland. This game I have nostalgia for without ever having played it. That sounds stupid, but I've seen like in magazines, in uh, kids gaming magazines or in uh, Mickey Mouse magazines, stuff like that. I've seen time and time again the adver uh, advertisement for Monster Force. And it just looked so cool to little me. Because there was this cool wolfman teen kid. There was this interesting looking Dracula kid and there was big beefy looking Frankenstein Frank kid I was just I always wanted to have this game but either every time I saved up for a game because back then in GBA times I didn't have the money the disposable income to just buy games so I had to save up for them time and time again and every time I had enough for a game Either I couldn't find this game anywhere, or I always found something that interested me more. And so I never played this game, but I always had, like, stupid as it sounds, fond memories of the advertisement. Because it just looked so cool. And so, few, I would say a few, um, few months ago, I downloaded it for the first time. Because I just remembered, oh wait, this game. So, we have character select Wolfie, Drag, and Frank. I think I'm gonna go with Wolfie, because I, I don't know, werewolves are always cool. <laughs> Welcome to Spooky Cemetery. Welcome to Spooky Cemetery. Adam quota, collect 4,000. Time bonus, finish under 3 minutes. Sure. Press the B button to shoot. Pumpkins can be destroyed by shooting them. Give it a try. Okay, so I can shoot whatever I am shooting because I am a werewolf. Seems like I'm shooting energy and for some reason I didn't shoot that one straight ahead. And I think that's some atoms for which I have 5, 000, uh, 500 now. Interesting. And now, I found a key, which opens this gate, probably? Yeah! It's a, this game has an interesting style. I mean, I freaking love Igor the Robot. Just, the look of it is amazing. Also, the effect, <laughs> the lightning effect is cool, because this is just a flat pixel art. Just a picture. And then there's another layer where the effects are playing on. That's... It looks really cool. 
Them pumpkins and enemies require a stronger shot. Destroy these by holding down the B button to fire a force combo. Boom! I fire the force combo. So, the pumpkins that say one need the force combo. And also, we are only at 518 atoms. Oh, were those enemies? I'm not sure. They look ghostly. I, I love that we basically know what we're doing. We want to rescue Dr. Victor. But, and get the help of Dr. Percy. But against what? Whom? Why? Where are we? Monsterland, yes, but... Huh? <laughs> Why can't we shoot stuff? Enemies destroyed with the force combo will drop valuable atoms. Atoms can be used to purchase tools and relics. So I think I should use that. Oh, damn. I should use the force combo. Oh, no. Way more often. Because we want. What was it? 5,000 atoms, I think? That's quite a lot. Unless there are some. Things or enemies that give us way more than these measly like one or two every single time. The force combo can damage multiple enemies or pumpkins. Line up your attack to increase the number of atoms you earn. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's that looks way better. And I don't know why that went to the left, but it did. Okay, so the more things I hit at once, the more points I get. Gotcha! Easy! Pumpkins contain tools like health and bombs. When you find a new tool, press start to look at it in the pause menu. Adam's total 638. Force level 2%. Attack level 2%. HP 9 of 9. Sure! Oh! Health, no item, health. Refill a small amount of health. So I'm guessing this is like a a potion that I have with me. Ooh, enemies. That I wanna try and kill with the force combo. As many as possible at once. Which didn't work. Yeah, okay, now that's better. I don't know, sometimes he shoots... Oh my goodness. How do I... Heal. What did I do? Okay, that looks... I, I, I just pressed the L button to switch around the items to see if I, how I would use... Yeah. Okay, that was the problem. Press the L button to cycle through your inventory, which I did. And then I tried the R button to use something, but it didn't seem like it worked. And then I seem to have like activated everything at once. Press the R button to activate the tool selected. Give it a try. Yeah, not anymore because there is nothing more. What do we have here? What is that? Magnet shot. Force combo grabs atoms. Ooh. Do I like use that? And it's just doing it? I mean, I just, I basically used it. Now I'm guessing that I have activated it for right now seems like it because I think when I shot through the shot actually grabbed them okay 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 sure by the way I like the running animation it what is that I want to go over there <laughs> running animation is pretty cool it reminds me of something like Crash Bandicoot or something because it's so almost floaty Okay, we don't have another key. So when we get another key, I want to get in there. And here we just shoot. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of enemies and a lot of atoms. Which is great, because we want the atoms. The Adams family, basically. No, that was not a good joke. I'm <laughs> sorry. <laughs> oh, wow. That was 500 atoms at once. Great. Line up better. Nice. Nice. Ouch, still, we're doing quite all right, you know what, let's... Those ghosts are a pain because they sometimes move, they sometimes don't. I found the key, that's great. Also, I am kind of a fan of the music. Oh! Music's cool. It's... 
it's spooky enough. <laughs> let's say it like that. Give me that. And let's heal ourselves. With what we just got. You've reached the level exit. Get to the exit quickly to receive the time bonus. We are... Yeah, time is... Way up. We would get the time bonus for three minutes. We are at four something. And also we wanted... What was it? 3000 atoms? But we're just... We don't care about that right now. We just want to get through. Yeah, four and a half minutes. That's nowhere near for the time bonus. But we got bronze. Don't know what that actually does. Welcome to my store. To drop unwanted items from your inventory, press select. Press the B button to exit. Okay. Shop for tools or relics. What's a relic? Relics make you more powerful while held in your inventory. They can raise your shot powers and health points. So, wait. Gives health increase, gives health increase, gives health increase. 5,000 atoms for one of those. Shit. So... <clears throat> Tools can be used in battle to help you or your hurt enemy or hurt enemies. Okay, so tools is what we had. Like healing and bomb. Hurts all enemies on screen, I thought so. And tools are the ones we can actually use. Relics are the ones that are just passively there and give us passive bonus. But then again, take away one slot. Where we could just uh, one slot which we could use for something else. Continue through Spooky Cemetery. Atom quota 4000. Time bonus finish under 4 minutes. Sure, let's let's see. Also, can we do it like this? Yeah, we actually can. That's cool. Great, we are at... Oh shit. Yeah, it doesn't matter. We're at over 600 now. Turn on the switch to open the gate. Some switches are on timers. Okay. That looks like a switch and that looks like a timer and we're through. Tap the B button three times to fire a triple shot. This shot is great for destroying enemies like metal pumpkins. Okay. Sure. We open up here, I think, right? I'm guessing. Also, can we shoot through there? Yes, we kinda can. And that's actually not a bad idea because that gives us way more atoms. Open this one up. You know, this game works surprisingly well. I don't know why I doubted that it would. But it actually works surprisingly well. If you have too many inventory items and want to get rid of some, press select to drop the displayed item. Yeah, we don't have anything, so we're gonna keep what we have right now. We're gonna shoot through here, shoot through there. Thank you. And here we're gonna oops, do this again. It works surprisingly well, but at the same time, sometimes it just doesn't. What did we just pick up? Health? Sure. Wait. What is this? <laughs> X-ray shot. Force combo... Was it force combo? The F combo shoots through walls. Okay. We could use that at any time if we wanted to. These pumpkins say two on them. Oh, they need two force combos. And also I can shoot through walls now, which would have been useful right now, because then I could have made a way better force combo. Whatever. Oh, wait. These metal pumpkins or iron pumpkins or whatever they were called, you want to kill with a triple shot. Also... Uh, didn't we just... Yeah, okay. Can I still shoot through walls? The answer is yes. But I cannot get these shit. Uh, that was bad. That was bad. Okay, we got a key. We want to get down there. 
I like that they give you these tutorials, but at the same time, they take you out qu quite nicely. <laughs> Try combining shot power-ups to destroy enemies from a safe distance. By the way, again, I am a werewolf. A kinda teenage looking werewolf. Right? So why is it that I'm shooting stuff? Why am I not attacking with my claws? Flex shot, force combo bounces off walls. Interesting. Okay, so the question is, are, do we still have the ability to shoot through walls? Doesn't seem like it. But that doesn't mean that we cannot kill enemies down here also, or on the other side. And also I just used the item where my force combo... Yeah, where my force combo um, takes... Uh, collects the atoms. We could use the one where it bounces off walls, but then again, I don't see why we would. Got another key. Is this where we came from? I am lost already. I don't think so. No, there was a gate down here. Great! This time we might actually be able to get our quota of uh, 4,000 atoms, right? Okay. Ouch. Stop it, ghosts. I just wanna destroy you without any hassle. That too much to ask. Seems like it. By the way, anyone loving the irony... Is it irony now? But anyone loving that I'm playing this more or less Halloween-themed game near Christmas? Nightmare Before Christmas and all? <laughs> All right. You know what? Uh, we're gonna use healing because I don't really wanna. I don't really wanna lose in Monster Force. And it's not a game that feels like it's meant for you to lose. Okay. We are still not. Oh wait, there are more enemies. We are still not anywhere near our quota. Uh, use this to then get the atoms, but I think that's all. Yeah. That's all there is right now. I don't think that there were any more places where we could have gotten atoms. I think to get the 4,000 you would actually have to... Oh, damn it, we're close with under 4 minutes. <clears throat> to get the quota you actually have to destroy every single enemy perfectly, I think? Let's see, relics, actually, give self increase, attack ring, normal shot power up, I'm not using my normal shot most of the time, and these cost 5,000, so way too much for us. Let's leave Igor's store. Save, because sure we are gonna... We're... Okay, cemetery trial. Okay, your skills are being tested, you have 65 seconds to reach the exit. Great, let's try this. We do have a... <laughs> Hold the A button while you are moving to dash. Oh! Good to know! No, I already thought that this game was pretty fast. In terms of running speed. But it seems like you can just go even faster. Which, I mean, doesn't really feel that much faster, does it? <laughs> okay. So, it seems, based on... Ah, oh, shit. Wait. What? Didn't I just open a gate? Oh yeah, right here. I would guess that every single world is like two or three levels. And then a trial. Okay, not here, but here? Yeah. Okay, okay, dash here. Oh, dash back now. There's no way we can do this. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, okay. I want to try this again. 
one more time. Because I think I can do this. Wait. Oh! Oh! Boss fight! Okay, great! Okay, let's use this shot and see if that actually helps. I would say yes, because it just helps us attack him multiple times. That thing looks very... Disney-esque, wouldn't you say? I don't have any healing, so I have to hope that we can somehow manage to get by without getting hit too much. But the ability to just let our force attack bounce off the wall is gone, I think. I th think we don't have it anymore, and we did it! And we didn't get to get that atom? I think we did. I think it just automatically gave us that one. Ooh! Gold! That's nice. Health increase, shot increase, force combo power up. That's actually good. Brings you back to life. Ooh. Those are... Eh, no. Let's say, screw this. All I want to see is what the next type of level will be. Village. I'm gonna go into the village and then we're gonna end the episode. Oh wow! Oh wow! Green pumpkin monster things? That actually see. Can I somehow destroy them? Because I've used the force combo quite a lot. Okay. So they seem to be easier, or do they seem to be only destructible by a th uh, three combo or whatever that was called? Okay, sure, why not? Different enemies. I do not know why I cannot do the three combo. So force combo is if you keep pressing it. And he said something along the lines of just Hitting the attack button three times. Now it works. For some reason it didn't work before. Whatever. Can we do it like this? Yes. And get all the atoms. I mean... This game is pretty charming. Gotta say, it's, it's a bit wonky in terms of... Oh wow. Like in terms of... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Control? The control scheme is technically really easy, but at the same time you see that every now and then I shoot into the wrong direction, or I'm standing basically right next to the enemy but don't hit them. It's just... it's wonky. It's, it's a Game Boy Advance game. Uh, it's... something... it's something. <laughs> it's something of its time. And, I mean, I love the art. The art style is great, the pixel art, the, uh, what's it called, the cycles, walk cycle, run cycle, stuff like that. It's cool. Also, wait, let's dash, yay! It, it, it's really well made, except for the gameplay, I would say. <laughs> the gameplay feels like it's the, uh, the weakest of this, oh wow. Gameplay feels like the weakest part of this game. Because everything else is really nice. I like it. Will I keep playing it? Eh, probably not. <laughs> Will I delete it from my hard drive? No, absolutely not. It's cute. It's nice. Again, I have nostalgia for it without ever having played it before. And that's something that... I don't think I can say about too many games. Like, maybe one or two. But anyway, thank you nerds so much for watching. I'm the Renegade Cactus and I gotta run. Bye bye!